Good morning everyone. We are going to start a new chapter of English grammar class 1. Okay. This is your book and we are going to start chapter 4 A and N. Okay. Now you must have confused that ma'am is saying A and N. No. This is we are I have written uh, uh, or for you. Okay. But in, in your chapter it is given and. Okay. Now let us start the chapter. What is it? A or N? Okay. I have written example over here. A balloon. When we write a sentence, okay, there are such uh, uh, you can say articles, uh, prepositions or uh, adjective has to used. Why? To make a complete sentence. Isn't it? Now we are using A N over here to make that make, make that sentence complete now what is the fundamental concept beside or behind the writing of a or n okay now i know that you have heard the name of vowel and consonant what is vowel vowel a e i o U, isn't it? Now come to the consonant. Leaving this letters A E I O U, every like remaining all the letters are consonant like B, C, D, F. G okay remaining till Z leaving this letter accepting this letter whatever letter will be there it is consonant okay now there is one rule you have to follow it while using A and N okay the rule is before like putting A or N you have to see the third letter or second letter even it is consonant or vowel okay if i have written here balloon b is here so b is what consonant then you we will use a over here okay a balloon okay now after that e is a vowel we are using n here make it very simple and very relevant okay that if there is a consonant i have to use a and if there is a vowel i have to use n completed now the second thing there is second rule if there is a vowel sounding word what is that vowel sounding word isn't it Like vowel sounding word means the word is starting from consonant but the sounding is vowel like our okay h o u r our okay h is consonant everyone knows s h is consonant okay but the pronunciation of h is o over here isn't it it is o over here okay so it will be what it will be a vowel sounding word and for that we will use N. Okay. Second example, honest. Okay. Honest. This is a consonant. Everyone knows this is a consonant but the vowel sounding word makes it a honest. So, it will be O. Okay. We will use N for honest. This is a second rule. Okay. Based two rules, you can complete any articles. At articles means A or N. Okay. Now come to the exercise part of this. I am giving you more example. It is very easy. Okay. It is very easy. Once you will understand, no one going to like make it wrong your sentence. Okay. Now I am reading something because it is there in your book. Okay. You should know. Think of 26 letters of English alphabet. It is correct. There is 26 letters in the alphabet. 
Okay, what is alphabet? A, B, C, D, E, F, G till Z. Isn't it? That is alphabet. Okay, and how many letters are there? 26. Isn't it? Now, there are 5 vowels and 21 consonants. As I told you, there are 5 vowels and 26, sorry, 21 consonant. Okay. All together make it 26 letters. Isn't it? Okay. Now. Sorry, sorry. Okay. Now, coming to the next line that is the noun that refer to one person, place, animal or thing that are singular in number. Okay. I hope you know what is singular and what is plural. Singular means something is one and plural means many. Okay. And we use A before a noun that be begins with a consonant. As I told you that F is a consonant. We will use A over here. Okay. And X is a, E is a vowel. We will use N over here. It is written in your book. We use N before a noun that begins with a vowel sounding word. That is vowel. Okay. Isn't it? It is clear to you. Now coming to the which part? Examples part or sentences exercises part. Okay. Now let's apply A. Write A or N in the space given before the following nouns. Isn't it? Now, number one is given orange. Orange. Okay. Number two, it's bell. B E double L. Number three, igloo. I G L double O. Isn't it? Now, O is what? Vowel. We will use A, M. B is what? Consonant. We will use A. Okay. I is what? Vowel. We will use N. Okay. Likewise, you have to complete all the exercises till 8. Now, after that, this is also easy. I have dash ca cat as my pet. I have a cat. Now, in this filling the blanks also, you have to see this, this letter. After, like before filling with your letter, see the next letter of that. You will understand it. This is a trick of using A or N. I will give you some of the worksheet so that you will complete it. Okay. Thank you.